my biggest challenge in life is that I've always been seen as different. I grew up in another country with a mother that was from Myanmar and a father that was from Sweden. Okay. I was always different and I always saw it as an issue that I couldn't fit in. Speaking English is such an advantage. I think, you know, all of the Miss Queens here, they probably have a similar qualities outside of the language advantage that this girl has, right? So when you speak English, of course, it's a big advantage. All right, so in this one, I'm going to react to a video of Miss Myanmar again. And this is by, uh, you know, I have to apologize. I do not know her name. I should have done some research. But I guess I was so obsessed with the way she speaks English. So excuse me, excuse me, so forgive me for not knowing or oh, for not making the effort to know her name and I should, I know. I've seen some of her videos and this is a video of her <clears throat> speaking English, not really speaking English, answering the question. And you know, the, kind of, the question kind of relates to me as well. Uh, let's just watch the video and I'm gonna react to the way she speaks English. Of course, she's basically Swedish, right? Swedish, Myanmar or Burmese, Swedish. I guess it should be Swedish Burmese. Swedish Burmese. Swedish Burmese. Right? Uh, Swedish, Swedish Burmese, I guess. <clears throat> anyway, anyway, you know, I know, I know there is some controversy around it, but still, uh, it's about English, right? Whenever I come across people, especially Myanmar people speaking English, I can't just help. 2024, Miss Myanmar, right? You have to choose one. You have to choose one. Bibuama, a Jimazo, Saint Kormuga, Bali. Okay, so right now, how would you translate that in English? What is the biggest challenge in your life? Good one. What is the biggest challenge Sorry. in life? How did you overcome that challenge? Please answer. Good question. Please answer, of course. Well, you know, I would say it's a cliche, one of those cliche questions, but it hits different, different, it hits different at different times, in different times. <clears throat> For me, it's a great question because uh, especially given the moment that I'm in, I think it's a good question for me. So I want to see how she answers and afterwards I will give my reaction. My biggest challenge in Smile. life is that I've always been seen as different. I grew up in another country with a mother that was from Myanmar and mm -hmm. a father that was from Sweden. I was always different and I always saw it as an issue okay. that I couldn't fit in. But I learned how to overcome mm -hmm. these difficulties and I learned how to get more confidence and love myself and I realized that what I thought was a weakness was my strength. So be different and embrace it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for your answer. Okay. That was a good, that was a good answer. <clears throat> and you know, to have a good answer, you gotta know the problem, right? I'm sorry, you gotta, you gotta first figure out what the problem is, what the issue is. So. I really like the way she, I think she, she had some sort of, she has a little bit of nerve, but of course you're, you, you're gonna have it, right? You need to have it because without having a nerve in a stage like that, how are you gonna feel the victory, right? You gotta have, for example, uh, a lot of fighters say that they, they're nervous before the fight. For example, if you watch some of Mike Tyson's, if you're at all familiar with boxing, or sports <clears throat> before the big fights they, they are very nervous they don't know what to do so that nerve is a, a sign of excitement a sign of the magnitude of how big of a moment this is so you gotta have that right so i, I could see I mean, I mean you can see she clearly has some nerve going on you can read she's a bit nervous but you know not too much nervous she she looks a lot more confident than <laughs> nervous of course so, good English, by the way, good, good English. Uh, she's from Sweden, right? I don't know where she went to school. I don't know how old she is. I don't know what she does uh, beyond this. I don't know what she does out, outside of this. I don't know if her 
mom speaks English.、Uh, she must speak English because she's married to a Swedish man, right? So、um, I do, I do not know all of the stuff, but you know, speaking English is such an advantage. I think you know all of the Miss Queens here. How do we call them?、Uh, the pageants, right? They, they they probably have similar qualities outside of the language advantage that this girl has, right? So when you speak English, of course, it's a big advantage.